Welcome and welcome back to another review by Projects. I'm Psycho, and in this part today with you, I'm going to be reviewing The Wolf Among Us, part one. Um, actually, episode one, Faith. Um, so, yeah, let's just get on to a quick, um, a quick description of the whole series. Oh my god, that guy has an X in his head. Um, that's nice. Um, Alright, um, on to the quick description of the series. The Wolf Among Us was a series made out of five parts, um, and the, the main part of the series was that your decisions affect the, the, the decisions of the characters and everything, and how the game revolves all around um, to, the, to the ending. So, the decisions you make um, di directly affect the the story and um, not only in the first part but in the later parts as well after transferring your saves that was the main the main thing that they that the producers wanted to achieve with the wolf among us um, and they they added um, a kind of a comic comic style look to to the whole game which makes it even more interesting to play and everything so let's just get on to um, onto the story of the first part well, I'm not going to do a, a long recap or anything, I'm just going to be real quick in a sentence or two. So, the, the whole point of the first part, Faith, is that um, after a long time of peace in the city, um, a new murder of a fable um, is, happens again, and that leads Bigby on a trail, the main character Bigby, on a trail of a new murderer in, in town. So that's pretty much um, a quick recap of what happens in the first part of the of the game, and the game actually revolves around everything. Uh, uh, revolves around this in the la later parts as well. That's um, depending on the decisions that you make in the first part. So um, as far as the graphics go, as you can see, the graphics are, as I said, um, in a comic style way. To kind of make it more, uh, more like a story and not like a game. Uh, oh my God! Oh yeah, I remember this part. This is the part where he pulls his arm off. Great part. Um, so yeah, as I said, it kind of resembles a comic to give it more of a story-like feeling than a game. To kind of get you into into the story as if you were in there, and it doesn't focus that much on the gameplay, but actually on the story and the decision making itself. So, um, that's, um, in my opinion, it's a really great game. The, the Telltale Games developers actually achieved a great, um, a great review of this game. It's probably one of the better games that have come out because of its, um, of its new style of gameplay, focusing especially on the story and not so much on the, the gameplay as well. Um, so yeah, I recommend it to all of you guys who like great stories and everything. Who who like that your decisions um, directly affect the the story in the game and um, and the comic book style as well. So that's gonna be all from my side. Don't forget to like and subscribe, comment on the videos, and I'll be seeing you in the next one.